What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Okay, okay, okay. I was having some technical difficulties, but it was for a good reason. Because you're not supposed to have the kids around for this one. Put the kids to bed, you know what I mean? Put the kids to sleep. This one is get your tapes ready kind of material. This is one of those, oh shit, I got to hear what she said again. Girl get the tea kind of interviews. So, I'm not going to introduce her. But she's going to introduce herself. North Carolina, please make some noise. Jersey, make some noise. The Tri-State is in the building. Who do I got in the building today? Dante Sexy. <laughs> in the building. That's right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I got the lovely Shantae Sexy in the building. So, I got some questions. I got some questions. What you got for me? <laughs> All right. First question. You know what I mean? How long you been in North Carolina? I've been out here three, going on four years now. Been a little, little while. I still feel new though. But wait, you're originally from Jersey, right? Yeah, I'm from Jersey, Queen well, City, Plainfield. Um. Okay. Listen. Thank God you moved. The crime rate <laughs> is kind of high up there. You know what I mean? I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna pray for Thanks. them. I'm gonna pray for the people that's <laughs> left behind. But hey, I understand. <laughs> Now, you know what I mean? How do you like the North Carolina music scene? Like, as far as getting your music out there, do you feel like it was easier in New Jersey or do you feel like it was easier in, or it's easier in North Carolina? Uh, I definitely feel like the, um, the avenues are more open up north where I'm from. You know, a lot of people already knew and they know what I do. Um, the challenge, which I love a challenge, is, is meeting new people, you know, that still need to get to know me. And I'm I'm making some real good connections out here and beyond this area. So um, definitely, definitely up north gave me more, more leeway. But it's okay. I like the challenge. I'm up for it. Oh, <laughs> you want them strong black women. You know what I mean? You ain't going to let nothing hold you back. So I give you props on that. Music-wise, though, because you don't have a sound that's like most people. What do you feel like your influences are? Wow. Ooh, you know what? I, I like all kinds of music. Like, I'm, I'm talking about, I listen to drums tapping from, like, Zimbabwe. You know, it, it doesn't even have to necessarily be, <laughs> you know, like, actual words. Or, you know, like, I listen to stuff like, and I'll be like, oh, I hear something. Um, I'm just influenced by my environment. You know, so music, I like jazz, I like soul, I like classical, love me some hip hop, reggae, you know, I'm West Indian girl, so. Wait, 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 wait hold on, hold on, hold on. You Jamaican? Yeah, yeah, full blooded West Indian girl. Blood, blood. <laughs> All right, it's gonna get a little bit more interesting. All right, so. When you were growing up as a child, because I have questions now, because all Jamaican kids end up having to do this shit. Did your parents blast son, um, Jamaican music all day, every day? <laughs> I, you know, it's real funny. It's like, um, both my parents West Indian, but my, um, my grandma, my mom's mom, she's Southern. So, you know, she, she did the whole, like, you know, the gospel music thing and, you know, it, it wasn't until a little, when I got a little older that I started to break out and listen to like, you know, like everything outside of gospel, but like, <laughs> my, aunt, my aunt put me on the record. She had me on today, you know, Shaba Ranks and, you know, okay. Pacho, she had me on to stuff like that, you know, <laughs> it oh, was a wrap after that. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, 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 okay. So, so, you know, you know, I'm from up top, so, you know, we do, especially Jersey, like, you know, we do a lot of house music, you know, so. So you like, so you got influenced by house music as well, too? Oh, yeah, you shake that ass, girl. You know, stuff like that, you know, percolate Oh, you know, shit. Like <laughs> Yo, I, t I told y'all this was going to be one of those interviews today, ladies and gentlemen. I told y'all, I told y'all, I told y'all. <laughs> so. Now, like, music. Wait, what are you drinking? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is my health tonic. Health tonic. What is yeah. a health tonic? Um, this is particularly amaretto sour. <laughs> 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 and I 
I'm a mixologist, so you know I had to put something together right quick. Wait, you're a mixologist? <laughs> I'm a mixologist. All right, what's your what wow. what drink can you make? Cause yo, she got drink. Yo, what time is it? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's about. Nah, no. as long hey, listen, they don't know what time it, it could be. Four o'clock in the afternoon, with the, with the way it look right now, where you at? Shit, it could be you three o'clock. It could be three o'clock in the morning. They wouldn't even know, but. Um, favorite drink to make? Here you go. <laughs> Amaretta Sour? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to send this through the cyberspace right quick. This is a special one. This is a, you know. I'm a little, hood. I'm a little <laughs> hood. So I put Hennessy in mine, so I'm going to give you a little Hennessy in mine. You know what I mean? We're going we gonna to okay. share. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> so music wise, you know what I mean now? Where do you feel like you're going to be in the next five years? Oh, wow. You know, I really, I really want to be like, I always tell people I'm international because I do have an international audience, but I really want to, um, really want to be a lot broader. You know, I want more people to be, uh, I want to really be a household name for more people. Um, you know, yeah, definitely. You're gonna be a household <laughs> name. No, nah, that's something to work for. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Um, yeah. But for the summer now, what I know that me and you just worked on a mixtape that I just finished up today. You know what I mean? That yeah. I'm gonna be dropping on Sunday. But yeah, what I know, what do you have in store for us for the summer? <laughs> Summer's I coming actually, up. I have um, I have this new album coming out. It's called Urbana. Ooh. I wasn't gonna tell nobody, but. You squeezed it out of me. <laughs> I wasn't gonna tell nobody. Yeah. But it's called Obama. <laughs> you know, you know, yo, listen, Wendy Williams ain't got shit on me. I know how to squeeze some juice. I know how to squeeze some juice. <laughs> yeah, we got that lifting over here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. So you're gonna be. Er, how'd you get the name though? Um, I came up. I came up with it because, like, you know, I was just thinking about how. Um, you know, my sound is real, you know, it's real unique. It's a mixture of a lot of different sounds, but this particular album is really going to be more urban. And, you know, I, you know, when you say like, uh, Latin words and you're speaking in a feminine form, you know, you're supposed to be the and I, and I always think I'm talking Spanish to somebody, so. <laughs> You know, how you doing? How you doing? Oh, shit. That's where the big bamboo, <laughs> that's why you got the big bamboo earrings right now? No. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but I'm just a runaway girl, so you know, I just gotta keep it. Okay, okay. <laughs> but on this, how many songs are you gonna have on this album though? Can I at least get some numbers? Some numbers. Woo. You know what? Right now it is five that I have already you know ready to go. But, yeah, ready to go, and um, you know, I'm I'm thinking about leaking them, you know, real, 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 I always put like over ten. I always gotta put over ten. I can't do just like four, five, six, seven. It's gonna be more than ten. All right, all right, all right, all right. And yeah, I still put that number on it just yet because I don't know. I mean, I might just. I don't know. I might do like the day of. Day of change your mind and shit. <laughs> <laughs> be like, yo, listen, nah, add that, nah, take that one off. It's gonna be thirteen now. Nah, it's gonna be twelve. All right. <laughs> So, <laughs> let me ask you this, because every musician has a favorite kind of producer. Who would you want to work with that you've never worked with before? Wow, 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 what's that? Let me see. There's so many producers out there, and I really, you know, it's kind of crazy, but one of my favorites, um, um, musical producers and artists was, you know, Prince. And I know it's it's uh, he's had a real unique style. I wish he was around because I would have loved to. I would have loved to hop on something with him. He's real funky Prince with his sound, nigga. but Prince uh, is nigga. dang, there's so many out there. Like I could just whew, 
cheapest creepers. There's so many producers out there. That's not even fair. See, good question. Um, no. Like you know, like you know, I like so many of them. Like, mm, it's really hard to say. It is. Okay, I got another if question. I, I can narrow it down. Hmm. I um. <laughs> I really like Mike Will. Mike Will made it. Uh, I like. I like his. <laughs> I like his beats that real um Mike Will. I like I like the trap sound. I like his trap sound. Mike. Um Wait, you like trap music too? Well pretty guys like trap music. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I got tingly inside how he said that. I got all tingly inside how he said that. I was like, oh okay. <laughs> I like that. I like that. I like that. I like that. <laughs> so Mike Will, nice, 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 nice. Good choice. Yeah, I went in my work. I went in my doing some music. You know, I'm. Oh my gosh. You know what? It, it's a lot. You know, and you know, I'm real. I'm kind of like that throwback girl. So you know, like I like that Swiss beat sound. I like the Pharrell monster. Sound. Swiss beats the monster. Now I'm gonna ask yeah. you a serious, serious question. Now this is important, ladies and gentlemen. How she <laughs> answers this. Who knows? But this is, you know, them Jeopardy question. Doo, 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 doo. This is the Jeopardy question. All right, <laughs> you have one feature left on your album. Going only fit oh. one more feature. Who is that oh. feature gonna be? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh Dead or alive, yo, you can even go to the studio I, and steal I a print. Say, who is Miguel? Miguel? Oh, mm -hmm. I like that. I like. No homo, I like that answer though. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you know what? <laughs> Females go, yeah. yeah. Yeah, you're gonna have a bang no homo. You're gonna have a bang on Miguel. Yeah, that's that. I'm saying like I, I just his his style is really unique. And I um I, I could see I could see some good music popping off it, Miguel. Okay. Okay. So a lot of people out there that I would love to do some music with. <laughs> All right. In hip hop room, yeah. Okay, so if you had a hip hop feature, who's your hip hop feature? That's not fair. <laughs> you could pick, mm. you could pick the wackest rapper Slim Jesus, or you could pick the greatest rapper Jay Z. Who would you pick? Um, Dag, this is so hard. This is real hard. This is one of so, the important questions. Because I love too many, I love too many rappers. Like this is really crazy hard for me. <laughs> um, I know, I know. <laughs> um, hmm, that this is hard. This is okay, the hardest. I've been giving out the good night. questions, yo. Listen, like, I'm I feel like thing. I feel like I'm doing one of those uh, standardized tests, and you just, <laughs> you know. <laughs> You know, you, you know you gotta get it right because you gotta hey, get it right. Hey, listen, I cheated. Hey, listen, I cheated on my standardized test. The FCAT, if you didn't pass, you wasn't going to graduate. I, I graduated. I I cheated. So what? My mom even approved of that one. She was like, you better, you better pass, boy. Do what you got to do. I said, bet. So, all right. I gave you a hard question, though. Still gotta give us an answer. Uh, but you know what? Whenever I get a hard question on the test, I'll be like, can I skip it and come back to it? <laughs> All right. I like that. You know what? That's good. That's the reason for interview number two. That's the reason for interview number two. That's so, a hard way. Like, so I need you to do me a favor then. Think about that because we're going to have interview number two. We're definitely going to have a part two now because now we definitely got to have a part two because of this because you're going to have to think about that. You're going to have to get back to me. The mixtape will have already dropped, so we gonna talk about that, you know what I mean, when it drops. Um, one last thing, can you tell everybody your social media, how to get you on Instagram, Twitter, all that good stuff? Everything Shantae Sexy, S-H-A-N-T-A-E-S-E-X-Y, at Shantae Sexy, everything, everything, everything. If you want to go on my website, it's bit.ly slash G-N-2-N, J-A-N-S-E-C-O-N-D. And um, you can find out a little bit more of the things that I'm working on and the projects. You know, I have some books out and the music and yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. You got some books for sale, too? Yeah, I have four get, books out right you now. You getting them Amazon checks? Amazon, Barnes & Noble. <laughs> yes. All right, yo. Make sure you promote your website one more time so black people, because you know niggas ain't going to remember shit. 
just so <laughs> these niggas could get that. And I'm gonna put it in the link below, right? So y'all make sure, right? You guys go into the link below. Y'all make sure y'all go into the link below, right? And make sure y'all go get those. Bo- Wait, you got four of them? Four out right now. Yeah, there's more make coming sure you out. Get all four, right? Make sure y'all go support because we all support each other around here, right? So, tell them your website one more time, please, because black people. N- no, sorry. Niggas. Ugh. Yes. Y'all niggas, we got to repeat shit for y'all. So, I'm going to make sure I leave it in the description for y'all, too. So, read the description, you know what I mean? And get the books. Support. What's the website one more time? The website one more time is bit.ly slash Jen second that's B I T dot L Y this the short link forward slash J A N S E C O N D and check me out to get and you can even hot take with me that way too. Oh, see <laughs> boom ladies and gentlemen I'm, I'm accessible you know a lot of people not accessible I'm accessible there's no excuse <laughs> see good I like that independent <laughs> artists keep that in mind all right now listen there's going to be a part two, ladies and gentlemen, because I didn't get to ask all the juicy, juicy questions, because trust me, I know there's some kids that's going to watch this one, so don't watch part two. Your mama watch- going to you watch part two, <laughs> and your mama call my phone about that, I'm going to come and, yo, listen, I'm going to come get your ass, all right? Your mama ain't going to be the one to beat you. I'm going to be the one to beat you. So I appreciate y'all. <laughs> listen, ladies and gentlemen, Shantae Sexy represent, Thanks. you know what I mean? <laughs> One more time, tell them your Instagram so they can follow you. Follow me on IG at Shantae Sexy. That's S H A N T A E S E X Y. Yeah, on all those websites. <laughs> all right, yo, listen, I appreciate you, man. You know, it's part two. You, we, do you think they're going to be ready for part two? Woo! Y'all got to be ready. This is going to be a little different. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, stay tuned. Yo, y'all have a good one. Part two, kids. Remember. All right, y'all. Shantae, <laughs> I appreciate